Hello everyone. We are the student of Elite English Medium School. Today we are here to present a small presentation on solar system. Our solar system consists of our star, the sun and everything born to it by gravity. The planets Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. Before planets such as Pluto, dozens of moons and millions of asteroids, comets and meteorites. Beyond our own solar system, we have discovered thousands of planetary systems orbiting other stars in the Milky Way. This is Sun. The Sun is 4.5 billion years old, a yellow dwarf star, a hot glowing ball of hydrogen and helium at the center of our solar system. It's about 93 million miles or a 150 million kilometers from the Earth and it's our solar system's only star. Without the sun's energy, life as we know, it could not exist on our home planet. It's Mercury. Mercury is the closest planet to the sun and is also the smallest of the eight planets in our solar system. For every two orbits of the sun, which takes around 88 Earth days, Mercury completes three rotation of its axis. It is gravitationally locked and this rotation is unique to the solar system. Venus. A day on Venus lasts stronger than a year. Venus rotates in the opposite direction to most other planets. Venus is the second brightest object in the night sky. Atmospheric pressure on Venus is 92 times greater than the Earth's. Venus often called as Earth's sister planet. Earth, our home, is the third planet from the Sun. It is only planet known to have an atmosphere containing free oxygen, oceans of liquid water on its surface, and of course, life. It's Mars. Mars has approximately half the diameter of Earth. It is less dense than Earth, having about 50% of Earth's volume and 11% of the mass. Its surface area is only slightly less than the total area of Earth's dry land. It's Jupiter. Jupiter is massive. It has magnetic field 14 times stronger than Earth. It is also known for its great red spot and has twice the width of Earth. Jupiter's environment is probably not conducive to life. The temperature, pressure and material that characterize this planet are most likely to extreme and volatile for organism to adapt. It's Saturn. Saturn is huge. You cannot stand on Saturn. Its beautiful rings are not solid. Some of these beads are as small as grains of sand. The rings are huge but thin. Saturn could fold in water because it is mostly made of gas. It's a Uranus. The planet is often duped and ice giant since 80% or more its mass is made up of fluid mix of water, methane and ammonia ices. Unlike the other planet of solar system, the Uranus till so far it essentially orbit the sun on its side. The, with the axis of the spin nearly pointed at the star. It's Neptune. Nearly everything we know about Neptune was learned from the Voyager 2 encounter. Like Uranus, Neptune's blue color is the result of red light being absorbed by the methane gas in the planet's upper atmosphere. Neptune's composition is believed to be very similar to that of Uranus. It's Pluto. Pluto is a dwarf planet that lies in the Kuiper belt and area full of hazy bodies and other dwarf planets out past Neptune. Pluto is very small and only about half the width of the United States and its biggest moon Charon is about half the size of the Pluto. Celestial object. Celestial bodies or heavenly bodies are an object in space such as the sun, moon, planets and stars. They form a part of a vast universe we live in and are unusually very far from us. The glorious night sky is dotted with such objects. When we observe the using a telescope, they reveal fascinating world of their own. Thank you. Elitni Ajhej Mulakat Lo Standard 1st to 12th Science and Commerce, Gujarati Medium and English Medium, Day and Residential School. 
સૌરાષ્ટ્ર યુનિવર્સિટી સંલગ્ન કોલેજ તો એડમિશન માટે આજે જ સંપર્ક કરો કેમ્પસ એડ્રેસ લજાઈ ચોકડી લજાઈ હડમતિયા રોડ ડિસ્ટ્રિક્ટ મોરબી ગુજરાત મોબાઈલ એટ